all right. I think this will be okay, right? <laughs> Inochi is uh, a creep. Yeah. Care with names. Okay, but I don't know how to like delete my name now that I'm on a live stream though. <laughs> You're creeping me out already. We didn't even start yet. <laughs> Uh, maybe it's uh, better if, if I don't look at the comments and we just start the stream. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> just put the. Uh... Okay, so to dedicate it to Inochi. I'm going to name our character after you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Try let's go. Go and get the KFC guy, Inochi. I'm counting on you. Oh, he's more into animals? Well, I hope there's an animal in this one. Look, there's a chicken already. Like, Maybe it is appropriate because there's like a giant poster of a rooster there. You sleep softly as the morning sun casts a warm glow through the window of your modest student apartment. Oh yes, I know we were. The world is peaceful and serene, you could stay in a moment forever. Or you could wake up now now now, your first day of culinary school. No time to sleep in. What's that? Is the this oh, is such an there. annoying noise. Throw it out the window. Throw yeah. Out the window. <laughs> you slept through the, the school year and annoying. gave up on the once in a lifetime opportunity to meet Colonel Sanders. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, Game shit. over already? You might not be cut out. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, wow. Oh, shit. This is like my real life. Oh, what a game. <laughs> Baby, when are you going to play games like this? <laughs> I okay. want to know too. Okay, <laughs> should we try <laughs> again? <laughs> okay, let's do it again. <laughs> okay, I didn't let's... know it would end up like this. I can't believe this is how fast I lost this game already. Oh, we're going to hear the sound again. Oh shit, it's so annoying. Oh, lying in bed, you stare at the ceiling, thinking about everything that awaits you at the prestigious University of Cooking School Academy of Learning. How creative! It's not like the cooking was anime, it's also uh, something like uh, cooking. Your mind begins to run. Who will be there? What will you cook? What should you wear? Time begins to fly by and you find your imagination getting away from you. Okay, you need to take this seriously or you allow yourself to dream, daydream a bit and think about the future. How would Inochi, Inochi uh, be like... How would uh, the real Inochi be, uh, take this? Would, would he allow himself to daydream or would he take this seriously? Yeah, let's see. What would Inochi do? <laughs> he would take it he option takes one. option one. Wow, you must be a hardworking career person. Okay, I'd better make sure to arrive prepared for the first day. I guess Inochi is not the type of person who would lose the game on the first try. <laughs> Stuffing it with what? Um, you both three your morning checklist, teeth brushed, hair combed, pits deodorized. Actually... It's a dating simulator. I think you need to capture the KFC guy. I think we're gonna or go for him. maybe some of the rival rivals. He loved to stuff the turkey. Yes, it's a dating simulator and you're the main character, Inochi. So pay attention. Nothing can stop you now. Okay, you confidently grab a biscuit, spread out the door and head off to class. Wait. Leon, was that you or was that a sound from the game? It was sound from the game. I didn't make any uh, crunching sound. Okay. okay. Looks like a KFC popcorn thing. Okay, 
Standing in a quad, you gaze upon a magnificent University of Cooking School Academy of Learning. Here comes your lifelong best friend forever, of course, Miriam. She's the most adorably awkward person you've ever met, and you absolutely love her for it. Who called the girl Miriam? Slap off. <laughs> okay. uh, good morning, Inochi. Are you excited for the first day of the rest of our lives? She's already freaking me out. He's oh wow, okay. Awesome. You are probably their first love interest, but you've just been ignorant your whole life, like any anime protagonist. I do. Okay, she smells like <laughs> Commitment issues? <laughs> wow. Wow. I'm loving the chat, guys. <laughs> I think the chat is more interesting than the game, to be honest. <laughs> Those hands look like she wants to touch you, you know, she. It yeah, does. It's commitment, it does. right? Alright, actually, I'm. Because I sure am excited, a little nervous. Okay, okay, a lot nervous. Wow, she has a lot of energy. What's the... It's just that this morning I made breakfast for myself, but well, then I ate it. I couldn't taste any love in the food. What if I'm no good? What if I fail? <laughs> Already crying. <laughs> Inochi is like rest of our lives. Girl, bye. <laughs> what is that food? <laughs> She's not furry enough for Inochi. Oh, damn. Uh. <laughs> Definitely, Miriam. This baby crying a lot daily. Ouch. Okay. <laughs> Dang, shit got sad soon. <laughs> Classic Miriam, raised by Master Chef parents, she's always held herself to a very high standard. Ever since we were little babies playing together and you rescued me from that quick sandbox, it's been clear to me that you're the most loving, caring person I know. You're going to do great! Ah, you're a great friend. <laughs> But with the University of Cooking School Academy for Learning's famous three-day only semesters, I'm afraid of being left behind and never catching up. Wow, it's only three days for a semester? What school is this? Lol puke. What? I have had bad boy issues. <laughs> Sounds familiar. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Sweet girl, Miriam has always had a flair for the dramatic. This summer she got so nervous about her first kiss that she chipped a tooth practicing on a mannequin. Anyone relate here? Can you guys relate? You know it, she, uh, I, I think you should be careful. She, I mean, think she already lost, uh, she chipped a tooth uh, when she tried to kiss. <laughs> <laughs> should you pep talk her or change the subject to give her some relief? Inochi, I'm not just saying that. <laughs> it's okay, Inochi. Our our main goal is to get with Mr. KFC. Second option, Second. please. Alright. Let's change to school gossip. Let's go. I don't gonna pep talk her. <laughs> It's hard to see Miriam like this, and frankly, quite exhausting. Rather than dwell on her anxiety, you try to change the subject to something more interesting. <laughs> All summer, you've been hearing rumors about dreamy, enigmatic mystery student who enrolled at this school. Mm. Is that the you and the main character, Inochi? Bare ankles are allowed, so wear a long dress with your shoulders covered as well. <laughs> yeah, that's a little worrisome, but you'll be fine. Now, what about this mystery student we read about on the school message board? Any new uh -huh. news? Oh, oh, she's happy already. Wow, she's very moody. 
I heard his name is Harlan and he's no ordinary student. Wow. Alright. Whoever made this game really likes to dig for interesting names. Oh my god, our name is Inochi for real. Now he's getting why so hard to date someone. <laughs> They say he has powers. He's had them ever since he was born from an egg. Oh, maybe not furry, but feathery. What do you think of that? An egg like a chicken? Don't be ridiculous. But that thing about having powers, it would line up with some of the other rumors I've heard. Like, I heard he once fought a bear with just his smile. How do you fight a bear with just a smile? Maybe his breath was really bad? I mean, if that works, I uh... You both start thinking about a student so handsome that the laws of physics don't dare apply to him. Dreamy. Before you can get another word out, you're rudely interrupted when someone smacks your books and custom engraves measuring spoons out of your hands and onto the ground. Well, it's very specific. I love her face though. She makes some really, really... Yeah. Some... Uh... He expresses himself quite well. <laughs> Is that the way all girls look at you? <laughs> Good night, Suzanne. Good night, Suzanne. Ooh, it's Ashley, your arch rival. She's totally evil, but you can't help but be filled with jealousy. She can't get anything she wants, and she knows it. <laughs> I think you can. I mean, like a Diddy, so I think you can even uh, date all the rivals and uh, rival girls. Oh yeah, who knows? You might end up together. As a heart on her boobs. Yes, she does. Hello, Ashley. Oh, I didn't see you there, chicken shins. Is, is that us? Chicken shins? Oh, girl. I think we're chicken shirts. You leave Inochi's shit alone. They're perfectly normal shits. <laughs> That's our best friend! <laughs> Thanks for standing up for us. Uh, you can't stand Ashley. Even her name is annoying. You know for a fact that's actually Ashley, but she had to hit extra letters to make herself feel better than everyone. If anyone here knows what perfect shins looks like, it's us. <laughs> We're not going to let you or your really weird insults get to us. Auto mod? Oh, is there a censoring in the chat? I don't know if you can undo this for us, Leon. I actually don't know. <laughs> Help me release me. How do I? Can you spell it different to make it show up? I think the the chat thing doesn't show some words, so they can't send um, some words in the chat to insult each other. Maybe we should let them insult each other. Okay, okay. <laughs> I, I can I can change it actually. Cool, cool. I'll, I'll change I'll change it while while you bring the. <laughs> Which girl are you? Oh well. Keep it automod. Wow, you know she really doesn't want to get those. <laughs> then it was finally a good girl. Oh, is that all you wanted to write? You wanted to write breasts? I think she, she wanted to write something already. else, but uh, it wasn't really allowed. 
I, I think I know, I know her. I know her, so she might actually uh, write something very different. Oh, chicken breast. I love chicken breast. I just had some yesterday. Okay, across the court you see Ashley's best friend, Van Van the Man Man, has stopped to look at his own reflection in the mirror. His pants are so tight you can see him casually working out his glutes while he style his hair. No lies, they're rocking glutes. I guess you know she is an ass person now. Oh god. <clears throat> Van Van? You rang rang? <laughs> Never been sure what their arrangement is, but as long as you've known them, Ashley and Van Van have been just as close as you and Miriam, but substantially more devious. Okay, good night, baby. Yes, good night. I actually trying to look, look for it. Can you change it in chat? Uh, the chat settings? Me? I think it's in the... I'm not sure. But since Fabi is sleeping, maybe we don't need to change the settings anymore. <laughs> or she's she, still she lurking. Just, she'll just lurk. <laughs> uh, Can't believe University of Cooking School Academy for Learning would ever allow people like you to attend as students. Oh wow, we're throwing the shade. I know, right? You think they just hand us our diplomas now. <laughs> or maybe hire us as professors. You amateurs could learn a lot from us. Wow. With the first day of school about to start, there's just not time to properly tell these two off, so you resist the urge. Let's go, Miriam. <laughs> See you later, loser. As you approach the door, you see a goofy looking kid pushing hard against the window directly next to it. What could he be doing? <laughs> Oopsie. I think it's broken. You reach forward and easily pull the door open. Oh, I thought he farted. I d I thought he farted at. I thought he farted at us. Oh. Uh, that should do the trick, right? So he just didn't know how to open the door. I love you. Oh, okay. Slow down, dude. Slow down. <laughs> I think you mean thank you. My name's Poop Pop. I was named after my pop pop. He's old. Could someone like this also be a student at this school? He must be one heck of a chef. Also his name tag clearly says Bob, but I guess he's reading it upside down. Cool. Hi Pop, I'm no cheese. So... Are you gonna make me hold this door all day? No. And with that, the young man walks into the building ahead of you. Is it just me or is he kinda cute? Dude, is that your type? Well, maybe they'll end up together. Oh, I think it's but just you. Know, you. you know she doesn't need to worry. You know she doesn't need to worry that he, he's going to end up with this girl. <sighs> I mean, maybe he's an option, you know, to get with. I mean, it's a dating sim. Anything can happen. Just. You both shrug your shoulders before following him into the building. <laughs> I'm not famous with girls. Maybe you never know. Uh, yeah. Probably, if you're I really mean, not famous, I mean. Maybe they're just shy. Yes. <laughs> okay. You stand at the edge of the room, unsure where to sit. Other students wander in and keep themselves busy chit chatting. I love how it's like maths when you're in a cooking school. How realistic. Scruffy looking pooch takes his place at the podium at the front of class. Adorable. Inochi! Here's a dating prospect for you! <laughs> Is it a female dog? We'll see, we'll see. Now, now, quiet down, everyone. 
I think he's a teacher. <laughs> I think so I think he's too. A teacher. What the fuck, Corgi? But he's also like on a on a pedestal that has like a chicken on it. <laughs> Who is this unreasonably cute pup, and why is he in our culinary class? You must be Sprinkles, head instructor and CEO of UCSAL. Please call me Professor Dog. I may be cute and little and fluffy, but I still demand respect. Woof. What cute dog is our professor? This is the best school ever. I guess only a dog's nose is capable of picking up all the nuances of fine dining. <laughs> How can you marry a dog? Hey, anything's possible in a dating scene. Why is that fruit still with us? I mean, don't ask me why she's your best friend. Out of nowhere, wind begins to rush around as you swirl of cherry blossom petals fill the air inside the classroom. I don't think we reject her yet. I think it's still possible to end up with her. <laughs> they always keep pushing people onto you in dating sims though, like, you can't escape that. I'm chilly, someone closed the window, and then... He walks in! <laughs> if there's a reject button, instant press that, Wait. no hesitation. Yeah, we is, all know is, you won't need to marry the dog. Speak? Do what you want to do. <laughs> You're immediately <laughs> swept up in the that's aura of this new student. student and his remarkable goatee. Okay, okay, so that's our thing now. So we like goatees now? Who knew anyone could be so handsome? Time stands still. It's the... That's no, your that love interest, Inochi. That's our love interest. But isn't he also the transfer student? Some kind of transfer student? He's the... He's the Herald guy, isn't he? It's him. If it isn't my favorite student, Harlan. Oh, sorry, Harlan. Colonel Sanders interrupts Sprinkles. The sorry, Professor Dog, before he can finish his sentence. Please call me Colonel. The dog can talk. <laughs> Colonel <laughs> Sanders. Are we in drugs now? I mean, you're seeing the guy from KFC, what do you expect? Hush murmur rolls through the classroom as Colonel Sanders walks down the aisle of dust. Suddenly the room is sweltering, sweat begins to beat across your brow. You feel like everyone is looking at you and you're not entirely wrong. And this over here must be sweaty, sweats a lot. Maybe we should open that window back up before faucet pits melts into a puddle and evaporates entirely. Holy shit. <laughs> <gasps> you, you two both know my name. We're in the same kindergarten class. And what is with all your really weird insults? <laughs> you take a moment to clean yourself up. Really? Are we gonna, are we gonna take that? Come on. That's only one option. Surely one you can option. come up with a good line. Like a comeback or something. It's a good thing you didn't forget about that deodorant this morning. This classroom is hot, hot, hot. Wait, did we start sweating because Mr. KFC entered the room? Or is it because of the other guy? <laughs> the other pet? Alright, professor, give us some ground rules. Welcome to this university, the greatest culinary academy in the world, birthplace of culinary legends, past, present, and future. Many challenges await you. There will be tears, there will be blood, there might even be adorable tiny food. And when all is said and done, there will be a battle. You will lift your sporks and compete in the broom cooking arena. Okay, there's some fighting, there's some fighting involved. The more, okay. I read, uh, the more I follow the story, the more I'm thinking about Cooking Wars, the anime. <laughs> I haven't seen it though. Have you guys? Cooking Wars. Just then, another student enters the classroom and interrupts the professor rousing speech. Season 1. 
Have you seen Eddie Nochi? <laughs> oh, oh, do you know the Japanese name of Cooking Wars? Uh, I know how to speak it up, but I don't think I can write it. Shoki Nochi is Kekina around. Soma. <laughs> wow. Got Shoki Kekina no Soma. I'm not sure if you can hear it. Can you type it? I'll try to type it, but sure. This poor dog, no one respects him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Hi guys, sorry I'm late. I hope everyone had a good summer. I really he miss. Looks really plain. Is he a prospective date? Looks really plain for a date. His hands are so creepy though, like... What the heck? Do you guys know Salad Fingers? He makes me think of Salad Fingers. That's like my childhood trauma. I think it has like 10 or 11 episodes on YouTube now. Late to class is bad enough, but interacting, interrupting my monologue, you're on the fast track out there, young man. Are you sure you're even in the right place? Don't you recognize me? This is my third year in this school with you as my teacher. Is a repeater. <laughs> There's that hint blankly. Does no one remember me? Um, oh, poor guy. He's one of those. You're expelled if you utter one more word before I finish. Show them the corgi butt. <laughs> Let that be a lesson to you students that tardiness is unacceptable. Even Clank if made it here on time. <laughs> Rolling halfway across town on his tiny wheels. Oh, I feel like every character is crying in this one. Turn to see the student sprinkles is referencing who appears to be some sort of industrial kitchen appliance. Cool. The class bursts into laughter. Oh, clank, you rascal. Sprinkles walks in the classroom as everyone stands in silent obedience. When he gets to you, he lifts his nose into the air and takes a deep sniff. Oh shit, well we used that deodorant, so we should be covered. Hmm, your diet is lacking. Based on what I'm picking up here, you definitely need a multivitamin. You should be taking better care of yourself. Oh shit, he's, uh, is he really going to poop here? Is he? <laughs> what? <laughs> You've never had a talking dog as a teacher before, but Sprinkle's reputation for being smart but tough is well known. You decide to try and buttering him up by giving him a treat from your pocket, but what kind? Hmm. What should we go for? Uh... Rubber ball, he's not worth more. <laughs> <laughs> I would also say rubber ball. Rubber ball? He's not gonna eat anything? Alright, actually, yeah. If it's a chef teacher, who knows what. Beef and snacks. Okay, beef and chicken. You reach? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh, interesting. Good. Interesting rumor. <laughs> So you're saying you've never video called on a toilet? You wanted a voice chat, not toilet talk. Wait, so you're saying someone asked you to call them from the toilet? 
but you thought they just wanted the normal call instead.